through the Windows app walkthrough portion of this project. So I'm going to start by launching the app. And as you can see, this is the layout. It has a main page, has a navigation bar at the top, and a footer at the bottom. And in the middle, it's just a frame that loads another page. So I have three pages, a home page, connection page, where you can set the IP address you want, and save it. And this is the IP address of the Maker 1000. And then the egg data page, where you can check for the number of eggs. And it says there's zero eggs waiting. So when I uh, put something past the sensor, um, I put by I move my hand past the sensor twice. So now there's two eggs that are waiting. So that is the overview of my app. Now here is the code in Visual Studio, and you can see there's in the app uh, .xaml.cs file is where the IP address is stored and gets saved to um, on the connection page. There's the main page, which just has the uh, the navigation bar and footer. The home page, connection page, and the egg overview page. So it's pretty self-explanatory and I think the only thing that would be a little hard to find would be that the IP address is stored in the app.sample.cs file. So, and one other thing is that there is an egg detail page, which I have not used yet, but it is built in and the button is just disabled. So that would come with a future release. Thanks.